I do want to talk a bit about being part of the Action for Change. I have to say, these were leaders in Ontario, yes, in Ontario, that got together to talk about some of the change that we need to see come forward at this convention. And I got to say, I'm really proud to have worked with such responsible and dedicated leaders. And we come from all sectors of this union. I worked so close with CUPE, and yet in other times we are rivals because of some representation votes that we're up against. But we were united in the last couple of months about coming here and talking about change. And I'm not talking about coming here and fighting with our CLC president. I'm not talking about coming here and fighting with sisters and brothers. This isn't what this is about. We aren't each other's enemies. We are each other's friends. We are the only social justice program for workers out there. We shouldn't come here and fight with each other, and I'm not going to stand here and talk about my past and how many times I've been up at the mic to talk about rating. You know SEIU's history. I'm not going to debate that. But a few years ago, when we were attacked, we had some choices to make. And we decided we were going to wipe ourselves off and we were going to change our internal structures in our union because, yes, those members did have some issues of why they left SEIU. We looked at our problems and we cleaned it up. And I'm proud to say that we have reorganized the members that we lost in that raid and that we are almost 100,000 members strong in SEIU. We committed to organizing. We went forward and we organized. We put a lot of resources into organizing. Our national union dedicates over 50% of their per capita into organizing. Our local unions right across Canada commit 20% of their post per capita dues into organizing. Because brothers and sisters, if we don't organize, what is going to happen to us the next time we come at this convention? I'm not going to stand up and I'm not going to fight about rating again. And unfortunately, those of you looking around the room, yes, SEIU a few months ago was accused in, in a raid attempt against an affiliate in this union and I am totally ashamed of it totally ashamed of it and I will do everything I can to make sure that none of my local unions will ever do that again and I'm committed to that as I'm asking all of you here to do the same thing we have choices to make we either continue doing what we do or else we make the changes and I have to say there's two choices we can be bold and we can be innovative what we can't be sisters and brothers is we can't be afraid and we can't be enemies so I ask all of you today, whether you're from Labour Councils, whether you're from Federations of Labour, whether we're from the CLC... We've got to wrap up, Shirley. If it's not now, sisters and brothers, then when? And if it's not us, then who? Thank you.